So today I'm talking about a P2403 code, what it is and how you go about fixing it. And so what is a P2403 code? Well, it's an EVAP system leak detection pump sent circuit open. And what does this mean? Well, modern cars have an EVAP system, which basically takes all the gas vapors from the gas tank and feeds them back into the engine to get burnt off so they don't escape into the atmosphere. This is for emissions. And the onboard computer seen a problem with this, so it's gonna have to be troubleshooted to know why. And some possible causes of P2403 code. Well, it could be a bad leak detection pump, could be the charcoal canister, could be in the wiring, blowing fuse, and possibly an EVAP leak. And so when you get this code, it's pointing towards the leak detection pump having a problem. And this is usually located on the charcoal canister. Sometimes they can't be separate, but it's usually located on the charcoal canister. So the first thing to do is go locate the charcoal canister, which will be up and underneath the vehicle by the gas tank somewhere. It could vary a little bit on its exact location. Here's a 2019 Toyota RAV4, and it's right up and underneath the driver's side door. It'll be up and underneath a metal protection cover on this one. But sometimes it could be farther back behind the rear axle or something like that but the first thing to do is to go locate the leak detection pump which is usually on the charcoal canister and then once you locate it the next thing to do is check out all the wiring going to it see if anything got damaged there's any bad connections anything like this you can also check for any blown fuses see if there's any problems there and basically just be aware anything wrong with that wiring bad connection open short blown fuse is going to cause problems so you want to check that out real good and if that all looks good, the wiring looks good, no blown fuses, nothing like that, then it's possible that this leak detection pump has failed. So the next thing to do would be to test it. There's some good YouTube videos on how you go about testing these. If it has gone bad, you can usually buy it separately from the whole charcoal canister. Although sometimes it can be better just to buy a whole new charcoal canister, especially if the old one is really old, because it might have a leak in it or some other kind of issue going on. But again, you can't buy them separately if you want to. But the next thing to do is to go test or replace that leak detection pump. And so if you got through and you checked all that, you tested the wiring, that's all good. There's no blown fuses that you tested that leak detection pump and it's testing good. Then it's possible that there's a leak going on somewhere inside of one of these hoses that's going to it and all the way around through the whole EVAP system. This includes the gas gas cap that's part of the evap system so check that out be sure that seal on there is real good and things like this if you took it to a mechanic what they would do is they feed smoke into the system and then if smoke came, started coming out one of these hoses or anything they would know where the leaks at and they'd be able to go and fix it that's a very good method you can't go around and see if you could see anything physically damaged and then repair it but sometimes it could be hard to spot there is some low-cost smoke machines that you could get on amazon or ebay i'll put a link down below if you need one you can also make these up yourself there's some youtube videos on how you can make them up for like five ten dollars but if you got through and you checked everything else out then very likely you have an evap system leak somewhere and one of these hoses are leaking and you just have to find that and so that's basically it i just wanted to give an overview of how you go about fixing a p2403 code if you have anything to add please comment down below if you have any questions ask me and i'll try to answer them if this video helps you please click like please click subscribe and have a good day